Uh, so I came from up that way. So I want to go check out down this way. I see a little goat dude sitting there. I think I remember those guys are called Grus. G-H-R-U. Be wary of miscreant. I really do like this sword, but I've, I've been kind of thinking about the fact that I already used this weapon in a Dark Souls game, so... Do I really want to use it again? I don't know. I, I, I love it so much. I kind of want to try the drang, the drang hammers. I feel like they'd be interesting. Uh, I just... Uh, oh, I do have the, the... I thought I didn't have the requirements to use them for some reason. No, I do. I'll just... I can try and level them up. I think there's a couple different weapons that I could try. Different, at least, like, types of weapons. Alright, so there is... Oh, is this the hill that I was trying to, uh... I think this is the hill. Okay, wait. I want to make sure that I don't accidentally drop down when I don't want to. Atonement. Is that a miracle? Attract more attention from foes. Wonderful. We definitely need that. Get them trying to kill me faster than they already want to. Hollow gem. Uh, that lets me add the hollow effect on my weapons. I don't like hearing you. Oh my god, there's so many basilisks over there. I hate them. Alright. I suppose I could just homeward bone. I don't know how many homeward bones I have. I got 11. I am almost poisoned. Or sorry, almost cursed to death because of these guys. I'm just trying to get out of the swamp. Can I get out of here, please? Before something else tries to kill me? Uh, actually, I do want to go to the Shrine Bonfire. I, another thing that I had remembered was that um, when I was crossing the bridge over to the tower, I noticed a, a way to drop down on like the roof, and the it looked like there was an item available. So I want to go check that as well. How do I get up there? This way? Hatches still there. Oh, you're looking mighty cozy over there. Oh, I can squat this just like you. Yeah, see you later, Patches. Okay, but we were coming up here. I already looked around here. That looked like a spider on the wall. But yeah, no, I think I can drop down here and get on the roof. I think it might hurt a little bit. Oh wait, I can land. I can land here. Make it less painful. Is that a crystal lizard that I'm hearing? There is a crystal lizard. Okay. I think I saw an item on the other side, but we'll, we'll scan around the outside of the building first. Make sure there's nothing else of interest. A couple of, uh, a couple of dead people here. Don't know how that happened. Over here, I think. Oh, there's a ladder I can kick down. Okay. I thought I saw a body, like... Oh, right there. 
Homeward bone. Cool. How did these guys, like, die? Oh, interesting. I'm in the rafters. This is the bird, I think. Um, ooh, that's a shard. This is um the uh, what is it? I forget what your name is. Is it? It's not Pickle Pea. That seem, doesn't seem correct. But in the first game, there was a bird that you could drop items into a nest. I think it was also in the second game. There's a bird and there's a nest, and if you drop things into the nest and then like reload the area, the bird will trade you the item depending on what you dropped a new item instead and there were a few items that you could like pretty much only get by trading with the bird uh i have no idea what items are available but it's interesting that they brought that back for this game too okay i think that's everything that i wanted to explore i didn't see any other paths anyway but I got a new Estus shard. Not that way. Gray rat's still chilling. I need reinforced Estus flask. Okay. That should give me 10 now. There we go. Beautiful. Hit the double digits on Estes. Alright, uh, I believe I was at the Farron Keep perimeter. A little bit of a detour, but that's fine. We'll get back to it. This way. Uh, while I was there, maybe I should have tried upgrading the hammers. Why is this guy just not reacting? Um, I have a feeling, actually, that this is going to end up leading to where the Black Knight is. This place again. Because I remember seeing a guy sleeping. I'm there's going to be a door over there. This guy's got a lot of defense. Uh, that one attack has like no tell to it. Ow. I'm I'm lucky to be alive. Got a couple of scales. Those are useful for leveling up weapons past the first few levels. I think it's scales and then slabs. Great magic weapon. Okay, yeah, okay. This is a shortcut to the Road of Sacrifices. While we're here, we may as well fight the Black Knight again. I think there's a chance I can get a weapon. Oh, shit. Well, Black Knight took me out. I wonder if that crystal lizard will respawn. The big old spiky lizard. Doesn't look like it. Mm -hmm. 
I would just like my souls back. Got him. Still no, uh, no good drops. I guess they I guess we'll stick with our weapons that we have for now then. Cause I know that they can drop some really good weapons in the game. At least they could in the first game. I think I remember like the Black Knight halberd being like busted. Okay. Uh, so I don't know. I saw a couple of people fighting each other outside like the gate here. And then that's about all I saw. People up there killing each other. Although they're not fighting each other now. Oh, that's uh, those are the dudes that have like the the red light shields. Although one of them is targeting me. That was a fast dive and I don't know how you didn't hit me. Okay. Dark mask. Ooh. Oh, he killed one of them for me. That's another one. See how he does against the last guy. Man, he just took them all out by himself. I'm impressed. Oh, there's another one over there he's going for. Hey, he's doing all the work for me. Looks like he doesn't see anybody else. But what about me? Can we be friends? Nope. Okay. We could have been. Like I offered. Amber. Is that another Gru? Yes, it is. Okay. Visions of illusory wall. Be wary of Quagmire. It, there, you're saying there's an illusory wall here because I don't see anything. I don't believe you. Alright, let's see what's up this way. I hear something. Like some kind of trap or something. I don't like these noises I'm hearing in whatever this building is. How does this guy not see me? Sometimes I'm not sure how close I actually need to get to pull off the, uh... Oh, there's two more. Pull off the backstab. Did you just not notice me at all? Okay. Works for me. Tight night shard. Let me check over off on this side as well. Other paths. Looks kind of barren. Okay. Uh, I guess it's into the creepy room. A lot of swords, it looks like. A couple of spears. Read message. Visions of Quagmire. No rear ahead. Time for good luck. Uh oh. Open up. 
Let me in. Boss fight. Something. Oh, they're fighting. Got him. I'm just in the background applauding the 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 victory. Good job. You did it. This dude looks like he's straight out of Bloodborne. Oh, I guess he wants me to join in on the fun. Sure, why not? Abyss Watchers. Okay. You say Watchers plural, which concerns me, because I only see one. I see a lot of corpses. Woo! Yep, that, there's another one awake. Shit. <laughs> I, I, as soon as I saw watchers, plural, I was like, oh no, I know where this is going. <laughs> it's kind of annoying though that there's two like multi-enemy bosses in a row. I guess, which boss did I fight? Did I fight a boss between the, uh, the tree? And yeah, I fought the Crystal Sage. Between the tree and the deacons, I fought the the sage. But the sage also had multiple enemies in it because he was just cloning himself. Ow. I'm trying to kill the Abyss Watchers. Leave me alone. He's just charging at me. Okay, did not lock onto you the first time that I tried. I don't know why you went for the second attack there. I did not hit the attack button more than twice. Yep, there's the other one. Nope, too far. I don't want to get cornered here. Thankfully, it seems like they don't they're not like too actively aggressive at the same time. Oh, that's like a clone or not a clone. It's like a, a mob. Oh, and he'll fight them, too. Interesting. I wonder if they'll spawn infinitely. I would like it if you guys could fight each other and leave me alone. Leave me out of it. Ah! <laughs> Go for each other, not me. Oh, shoot. That one has red eyes. I've actually lost track of which one's real at this point. I think that one's the real one right there. Holy crap. All right. So I wonder if there's like two factions of them, the red eyed ones and the normal ones, because those guys never really seem to go at each other. But the moment a red eyed one showed up, he turned and focused on him.
All right, rematch. That body is much more like colored than the other ones. Ouch. It looks like it's, I think it's timer based whether they get up or not. Yeah, the ones that are red eyed get attacked and the other and the ones that aren't don't. Well, there's a red-eyed one behind him. Ah, oh, come on, I was trying to roll. I get the feeling there's going to be a second phase to this fight, too. This feels, it feels, even though I know I've died three times, this feels too easy. I guess we'll find out. Maybe I should just keep my uh, trash talk about how easy the fight is to myself until uh, <laughs> until I win it. Okay, I want to get in. First priority is always grab the souls. I feel like I want the red-eyed guy to show up and help me distract with the secondary enemy. There, he's getting up. Why is the red guy attacking me? I thought he and I were going to be chilling. That's that guy down. I was not expecting that spin. That's fine. Another guy just woke up in the corner. Shit. Focus. That was a spin attack again. Ooh, red guy into the in for the save. <laughs> okay, he's dead. Who's going to get up now? Is it going to be the red guy? Or all, or all of them? All of them could get up too. <laughs> oh no. What's happening? Oh, all their blood. All their blood is going to him. All right. Uh, and his sword's on fire. That's how you know it's the second phase. <laughs>
There, right, here we go. Hi there, friend. Are your are your allies going to sh be showing up in this phase too? That was faster than I was expecting. Interesting. Okay, a flame line following his swings. I don't know why I keep doing this side swing attack instead of the vertical one that I like. Oh, it's because I'm, so, I'm it's because I'm one handing it. That's why. Ah. Yikes. I got to remember the fact that he can shoot a line of fire at me. I wish I got that hit there. That's a 10. Hello, Elena. Retreat. Go for the sip after he attacks. There you go. Shit. I didn't want to attack there. I wanted to heal. All right, we're okay. I just got to get one more hit. Okay. Got him. Cinders of a Lord. Oh, wait, that, that was a Lord of Cinder. I thought the first Lord of Cinder I was going to find was Aldrich. I feel like I remembered the, uh, the, some kind of watchers being Lords of Cinder. I didn't know these were in. Visions of Betrayal. I, the, the lore of this one would be interesting to learn. I always get fascinated to learn about uh, like the lore of these enemies, but I usually don't like watch lore videos until after I've beaten the game. Is that like a cup on an altar? Visions of Finger. I did it. We all did it. We did it. We are the winners here. That was pretty rough, though. The second phase with the... Ooh. Hey there. I hope you're enjoying the videos of the Dark Souls 3 adventure with me and my best friend. I'd love to hear what you all think, so please leave a like or a comment and consider subscribing to follow my journey to beat as many games as I can. Thank you for taking the time to watch, and I'll see you in the next one.